DNA, also known as deoxyribonucleic acid, is a molecule. It's a bunch of atoms stuck together. In the case of DNA, these atoms combine to form the shape of a long, spiraling ladder, sort of like this one here. If you ever studied biology or saw the movie Jurassic Park, you probably heard that DNA acts as a blueprint or a recipe for a living thing. But how? How on earth can a mere molecule? This here is a simplified model of DNA. It shows us that the steps of the ladder are made up of four different kinds of chemicals shown here by different colors and letters. If you look at just one half of the molecule, you can read its chemical sequence or genetic code from top to bottom, sort of like a book. A single strand of DNA is extremely long, millions of letters long. It spends most of its life coiled up like a noodle, living inside the nucleus or the centerpiece of a cell. Special chemicals inside the nucleus make partial copies of the DNA code. These partial copies, called RNA, look a lot like DNA, but they're shorter, of course, and they're missing one of their sides. Their small shape and size allows them to fit through tiny pores in the nucleus, out to the cytoplasm, and into the mouth of another particle called a ribosome. DNA is a molecular blueprint for a living thing. How does it work? DNA creates RNA, RNA creates protein, proteins go on to form life. This entire process, as complicated, as sophisticated, as magical as it might seem, is entirely based in chemistry. It can be studied, it can be understood.